hey y'all welcome back to my channel and from the title of the video you already know what's about to go on i'm about to show you all my stock pile i want to show you where i keep most of the items that i uh that i have in my coupon stockpile but if you do want to know where i keep the rest or if you want like a part two comment below let's see put part two just put part two in the comments and then that way i know that you all would like a part two but yeah i'm gonna show you all where i keep majority of my stockpile items that i've been couponing from all of these videos and if you're new to my channel thanks so much for you know clicking on my little old video and go ahead and subscribe if you haven't subscribed already and those who have already been subscribed thanks 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 so much but without further ado y'all let's go ahead and get into this video so you all can see what i've been cooking up or what i've been stocking up in my stockpile so let's go ahead and get into the video guys all right y'all so let's go ahead and take a look at my stockpile this is where i keep probably about 85 percent of my items so typically at the top i'll keep some of my paper products i have moved some of them into my garage because if you saw the video where cvs had where i got all that free tissue and um, paper towels from cvs i um it was too much to put up here so i ended up having to put some in the garage so this is just some of the paper products um that you see up here and comment below if you like this brand, the Babu. I actually like it. I know it's like either you like it or you or um, either you love it or you don't. Um, but yeah, it's like three plies, real thick. But I know some people don't like it, but I actually like it. So comment below if you've ever tried the Babu tissue and if you like it or not. But yeah, at the top, that's where I typically keep like the paper products. So the paper towels, the tissue. But like I said, most of it is in my garage currently. And then when you get down to this next shelf over here, we have like deodorant. What's this? Oh, I just put this up here. These are like the Garnier makeup wipe removers. We got some shaving gel back there. Some Tide and Gain. You all saw this from my CVS video recently. I think about two CVS videos ago where I got those completely free. Got some body wash. Got some L'Oreal Age Perfect. Got lotion. Hand, random hand sanitizer. <laughs> All of the oral care items. Got some floss picks there in the back. Let's see what else. Okay, and then we get down to this row. We have some dryer sheets. A lot of game dry sheets, some snuggle, got some snuggle beads, some other in uh, fireworks, game fireworks, random Febreze spray, Purex, all detergent, some game, and then if you come down here. That's where I keep most of the, like, Tide Pods, the actual, like, packs of laundry, like the ones in the little packs. So we got some Purex, all Tide. Got some Arm & Hammer back here. We have more Tide. More Game. And if you all remember this, I got this from uh, Kroger. They were like 75% off. And then we had some digital coupons as well, which ended up making these extremely cheap. And then we got some fabric softener. And I don't know if you all remember, a while back, Dollar General, um, there was a dollar digital that was attaching to these, making these completely free. So then we got the fabric softener over here. Downy, snuggle. And then down here, we have all of our like, feminine care. So a lot of the whites and tampons you'll see down here. And then a lot of the like the, uh, the pins and things like that. 
And over here, I have some diapers or pull-ups. Definitely got to keep those stocked. Down here, we got a random thing of paper towels. Move some of this stuff out the way. And I do sell my uh, items in my stockpile. So I can only imagine what it would look like if I didn't sell some of my items. But now down here at the bottom, I have more diapers and pull-ups. Over here we have, let's take this out. This is where I keep like all of the razors. I got razors for days. And as a couponer, razors we typically get for free. They end up usually being like a money maker too a lot of times. Especially if you, and if you haven't seen my recent CVS video, definitely check it out. Because I actually did a razor deal and that was a money maker. Uh, but yeah, this is where I just keep the razor, like the razor refills, things of that sort. We got some more all. Let's see what's in here. Oh, I remember this. I, mean, I don't know if y'all remember the video, but Kroger... These were, I think they were 90 percent off. They were really cheap, but like the holiday for Breeze plug-ins. Got some ear wick in here. This is just like the, the plug-in refills, things of that sort in here. And I got a whole nother bag. Same thing. That you'll see right here. Okay, just some more ear wick. And we also, down here, we got some always discreet pads, Let's see. some poise pads, some more CVS panty liners. So, yeah, I just keep, like, the panty liners, some of these little smaller packs of pads. And then we got more diapers. And I know you all remember Walgreens. They were, like, 90% off. I want to say they were, like, 50 cents or 80 cents for these pull-up diapers. And then these um, good nights as well were really cheap also. And this big box as well. I remember getting that from Walgreens. But yeah, just some diapers down there. And so this is pretty much my stockpile. Like, like I said, this is pretty much like 85% of my stockpile. So let's see where it'll be a couple months from now. But like I said, I do sell my items in my stockpile. So you definitely probably would be, I definitely probably would have a lot more if I didn't uh, do that. But yeah, this is where I keep majority of, of my items. So let me just put this stuff back. Let's see. Oh, and then over here, Just some like, I have some shampoo, conditioner, Dove, more um, toothpaste. Toothpaste is another thing as a coupon you get for uh, free as well. Or a lot of times they're money makers. So as a couponer, you typically don't pay for like toothpaste and razors. Those are something you typically get free all the time. <laughs> the beads for the kids. <laughs> and then we have more shampoo, conditioner. Got some baby items back here. What's this? Oh, detangler spray. Got some Tresemme there in the back. It's kind of dark. Let's see what's over here. Not too much over here. These are like items we actually kind of use. Let's see. All right. And then in this random little bucket, I just have like the travel size shampoos. I don't really use these. These are typically things I'll give away for free. But yeah, just some travel size shampoo conditioner in here. Where I keep like the makeup products. What's this? Okay. Yeah, yeah just makeup, lipstick, foundation, things of that sort. Got some random eye drops in here. <laughs> Nail polish. But yeah. This is. This is my, my stockpile. Ooh. 
This is all the items that I currently have in my stockpile. So yeah, I just keep it all in this little closet in my kid's bathroom. And then, like I said, I have some stuff like in our kitchen, in our garage, underneath my sink, my husband's sink. <laughs> but majority of the items are in here. But yeah, I definitely hope you all enjoyed watching this video. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. Go ahead and like. Go ahead and comment below. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.